In this lesson, we're going to create a lever or a switch which will open a hidden door. So the idea is we can go around this maze, we can collect all the coins, but currently there's no way to leave this level and get to level two. So what I'd like to do is to have maybe this tile here as a special hidden door. Maybe there's a switch here. We hit the switch, the door opens, and then we can transition into level two. So let's have a look at how we can do that. Now the lever will probably be used across multiple scenes, so it makes sense to create the lever as a scene of its own. So I'm going to click on plus to create a new scene. I'm going to click on other node, and this is going to be an area 2D. So very similar to the coin, the properties of the coin we want in this lever as well. So when we touch it, we can send a signal to say, hey, open the door. Let me just rename this area 2D to maybe switch or lever, whatever you want to call it. You can see we've got this warning triangle. We know what that is. That's about the collision ship 2D. We'll take care of that in a second. And what we want to do is add a child node to the switch, which is going to be a, an animated sprite. And the reason it's an animated sprite, we're going to have a left and a right lever position or switch position. Go back to switch, another child node. This one is going to be a collision ship 2D. In my animated sprite, I'm going to go to frames, new sprite frames, and then click on sprite frames to bring up this panel here. In my file system on the left, I do have the lever left and lever right images. I'll just drag those across and drop them in here. Currently we have speed set to five frames per second. Obviously we're not going to be actually animating this, so I can turn that to zero. It doesn't really make a difference and we don't need to loop it either. Let me just move this across so we can see it a little bit clearer. And the first thing I think is let's add this collision ship to it. It's going to be a rectangle. And we can make this a little bit bigger. Up there and down to there. Just come in a little bit. There we go. So that should take care of the collision ship. I'm going to go back to switch. Now this switch is a little bit big for our maze. So I'm going to go across to my inspector under transform and in the scale change this to maybe 0 0.2 and 0 0.2. I'm going to press command S to save this and save it as switch and save. And I can go to level one, making sure level one, this top level node here is selected and I can instance that scene, so that switch scene. So click on this little icon here to instance the switch. Double click and there is my switch. I'll just drag that into position here. Now, as I said, the player is going to collect the coins, go around to this switch, touch the switch, and that door will open. And we'll take care of that in the next video.